So as we left off from last time, we had our battery pack, our LED, our resistor and LED. I'm going to put this resistor back to a 1K resistor. And I'm going to take and bring this back down to leave this at two batteries. So if I start simulation, we have a decently bright LED. Now I'm going to add a second LED. And the way I'm going to do that is I'm going to take and drag a second LED on. I'm going to delete the wire. I'm then going to run a wire between the cathode of the first LED and the anode of the second. So it's from the negative to the positive, And then from the negative of the LED back down to the negative of the battery. I can also change this LED to a different color. Let's make it blue. And I'm going to hit start simulation. So they're on, but they're both half as bright. Let's boost this battery up to a four battery pack. That was a nice bright thing. So now I have two bright LEDs. Let's add a third LED. I'm going to take drag a third one. Delete this wire. Run a wire from the cathode to the anode. And then cathode back to the negative of the battery. And start simulation. Now, as you notice, they're going to start getting dimmer. The more I add, the dimmer the circuit will get. Because they're using more electricity, it takes more voltage to drive them. We could boost that up by changing the battery over to like a 9-volt battery. Or we could take our resistor and make it smaller. But as you stack batteries up, it can get more, it can get dimmer and dimmer because we can only set so many things. These LEDs are what's called a series circuit. We'll talk about different types of circuits later on this course.